Okay, so I have a problem. I've got a PTO here, the front half shaft of this New Holland 1409 disc bind is stuck on one of my tractors. Right here. So, let me show you here. Let me shed some light on it. So I took that collar off right here, this part. Uh, there is a spring that fits right in this groove here. That spring right there. And it's a retaining clip. I pried that off with a pair of adjustable pliers and a screwdriver. And then... There are these, those uh, four balls right there. See those little ball bearings? Well, they hold a wedge. They center two wedges. They keep everything in that groove. When well, you can see there, there's no wedge right here. There's a wedge in the bottom though. So I've got this clip off and I got the sliding locking collar, which is this part here. That slides back and over like that. I took this pin, this keeper clip off, just pried it up with pliers and the screwdriver pops off. Then you have the spring right here. See the spring? And that's what makes that collar slide, keeps tension on the collar. So I got the collar off and I could still not get that off. I tried Hold on that collar. The collar's supposed to come back, loosen up these wedges, so then the slides off. So I'm gonna rotate this around and show you the wedge on the bottom. Maybe that's what's stuck. But I hooked, put a come along on this to a tree and it moved the tractor. Wouldn't wouldn't come off. I'm gonna roll this around. And we can look at that bottom wedge. that wedge right there so was that stuck that to me I gotta try to to me I got this wedge must be stuck that collar when I pull a collar back on This must be, that spring must hold that down. So to me, I'm gonna get something like a punch, try to tap on that, maybe I can get that to come up. Okay. Let's see if I can get that chisel, that wedge to move. Apparently these balls you see here, they're so center of those wedges. Now the one on the bottom is gone. I got no idea. If this will work at all or not. I did some looking on the internet, tried to find information on this, and I was unsuccessful. So thought I'd make a video of me working on this. Okay, you can see that ain't doing anything. I'm gonna see if I if this will work. Nobody's given me any good ideas on what to do here, so. Hmm. Looks like it's gonna take a while.
Yeah, I think my bit's getting dull. Drill it some more. Okay, finally getting somewhere. Just able to tap this chisel here. Get this thing to start popping up here. That's it. Went back down. Okay, give me a minute here. Okay, you see that wedge? Finally going to get that out of there. By the way, it's January. These damn PTO's been stuck on there for several months. You can tell it's not hay season. Oh, maybe this will come off. Nope. Ugh. Okay, let me get it all the way out. We'll see what happens. Okay, you can see I almost got it out of there. Which is good because my drill battery's dying. I'm parked in my, tr that battery's been in my truck for a couple weeks. I had to warm it up on the dashboard of my truck. Okay, I'm going to put the camera down here again and try to pop that out of there. Okay, that is out of there. Now, oh, does that mean it's going to come off? No, it doesn't. What the hell now? Okay, well, I got the wedges out. Now I'm still stuck. So, the wedges to me appear to be stuck, so now what's the problem? Okay, I'm finally getting somewhere. I'm able to stick the crowbar here. See, it's moving. After months, finally got this off. See where those, see down there where those wedges were. Still. I am kind of wondering actually if this yoke is bent. That just shouldn't come out of there that. Shouldn't be that hard to get that out of there. Okay, I get something else to wedge with. Okay, so got this out of here. And I've never had them apart. I called the dealer. He never had them apart, but called up there to Miller's in Corona, my New Holland dealer. So basically, you got a wedge on that side and on this side, okay? These balls line, keep the collar centered. That's all they do. This spring goes in there like that and that keeps the collar forward. So when you want to undo, and that's, this is all retained on by a big snap ring that goes in that groove. And apparently, when you pull back, oh, this is not, why that's, I don't know why they ain't going back now, but I got this kind of roughed up. Apparently, when you pull back on the collar, but I don't see that happening. It's supposed to take, it's supposed to unblock those wedges. So when you pull back on the PTO shaft, those wedges are in that groove on the PTO of the tractor. And they're just supposed to ride up and out and allow you to unlock, I guess. But it seems like to me when you pull this back, 
it would push down on the wedges. So I, I'm still a little confused here. If anybody knows a little bit more, uh, sure would like to hear it. But I was able to pry it off getting that wedge out. I had to drill it out and tap it out. So, um, you know, I don't know what the hell happened. I don't know if those wedges locked up. I don't know if I got something messed up in here. I'm leaning towards that this part actually might be bad. But uh, anybody got any information, I'd like to hear about it because anybody will talk to anybody and give me much help on these. Thanks.